Tom Petrovsky joins us live for a look at the numbers today. Uh, how are we looking, Tom? Pete, well, in the bigger picture, it's looking quite encouraging in terms of what the futures are assessing for our own prospects today. It's a pretty modest improvement, but still on the positive side of the ledger with a gain of around 0.2 of a percent expected. And I say that's modest because we've seen some very encouraging moves higher as far as US and European stocks were concerned last night. Uh, last day, we were talking about US CPI figures. There's another very important measure that the markets look at closely, of course, and that's producer inflation. And these numbers were were moving firmly in the right direction last night in terms of the numbers for March. So uh, the headline rate of producer inflation uh, had its biggest fall since April of 2020. Uh, and we've got the core rate of inflation now at its lowest level since March of 21. So uh, the inflation numbers at the consumer level were in line with the market's expectations. These were firmly below expectations, Pete. So uh, this was very good news for uh, the markets and long-term interest rates. Uh, stocks rose and uh, long-term interest rates fell. We had the Dow Jones up by about a percent, uh, the S&P 500 up 1.3 percent and the Nasdaq up by around 2 percent. So very firm improvements there. Uh, European markets also were moving higher for a variety of regions. Uh, some encouraging earnings numbers. I know you're fond of of a, uh, a luxury good yourself. So LVMH mm. shares were up very strongly last night, up by 5% on the back of strong uh, sales numbers. Uh, there were better producer uh, um, factory production numbers. Uh, we saw the German market up by 0.2%, the French market a record high of 1.1%, uh, and the FTSE up by about a quarter of a percent. Well, speaking of the French uh, and luxury goods, Louis Vuitton had its store raided in Paris overnight, Tom, uh, because of those uh, riots relating to pension reforms. Uh, so... Uh, maybe people are after um, you know, some cheap goods from, from LV. You got any of that, by the way? It's, it's, it seems a bit of a contrast in emotions. Not prepared to work, but still prepared yeah. to you know, ransack a store. I think they need to get their uh, priorities <laughs> yeah, in true. order, Pete. Tom Petrovsky, thank you, Tom.